Okay, on another shootout, and uh, this one is, I should say actually, that's at the start of this one, that this series of um, non-filming shootouts is really aimed at people who use FL Studio from ImageLine, which is a, uh, a door, a digital audio workstation, and want to pick a laptop or system uh, to run it on. So um, I get a lot of laptops and devices going through my hands and I try and run this same basic test which is the image line processor performance test. So when I'm reading out these numbers to you they are the percentage of processing power as decided by the app itself, as decided by uh, FL Studio and ImageLine, the creators of FL Studio. Anyway, that's probably enough blabbing. Um, on the left, we've got the brand new Surface Laptop 7 with a Snapdragon X Elite processor, 16 gigs of RAM, which is the base for the new series of laptops. And on the right, we've got a MacBook Air with an M2 and eight gigs of RAM. No, I'm telling lies. On the right, we've got a Surface Pro, Surface Pro 9, uh, with the SQ3 processor from last year and eight gigs of RAM. So um, the new Surface laptop on the left has the advantage, um, but the Surface Pro 9 did really well against uh, a MacBook Air, as you might imagine, MacBook Air M2 uh, a couple of days ago, and that's available for you to watch um, on the same channel if you're interested. Anyway, I'm expecting quite a tight um, race. Um, I don't know what you call this, actually. Anyway, comparison. Um, Anyway, I'm blabbing again, so I'm going to hit the start and let's see how we get on. So the first reading is going to be the laptop on the left, which is the Surface Laptop 7. And then the second reading will be the Surface Pro 9 on the right. So off the blocks, we've got 17 versus 17. So neck and neck to start off with. It's a good start. Uh, 18 versus 16. Uh, 16 versus 16, so they are neck and neck at this point. Um, it may make a difference further on in this uh, song, which is one of the default songs, demo songs from uh, Nine Loops called Keep It Simple, which comes free with uh, FL Studio along with a lot of other songs, songs that you can listen to and learn from. Um, I'm blabbering, let's go back to the settings. We've got 17 versus 16. Uh, 18 versus 18, so neck and neck. Um, coming into the faster section now, which is going to require a little bit more processing power. Um, it's not going to tax either of these two laptops too much, I don't think. But we're up to oh, 16 versus 15 at the moment. So, and there we go. We're now at 24 versus 23. So the Surface Pro 9 from last year got the slight edge, although not much in it. 21 versus 25, 24, so the Surface Pro, rather, on the right, um, working a little bit harder, although no, neck and neck. We're looking at 26 versus 26, uh, 33 versus 30, 30 versus 27, 29 versus 28, 34 versus 29. So the Surface Pro 9 with the XQ, S, blah, 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 SQ3 processor from last year um, has probably had a lot more work on it, I guess, in what you term the emulation layer between the processor and the um, software running, which is x86 based. There is no ARM version of FL Studio, except, of course, for the Mac, Mac OS. Uh, and we're looking at 21 versus 19. So let's call it a day there. Almost neck and neck, but I'm giving it to last year's Surface Pro 9 with the SQ3 processor in what is a very um, specific test. As I say, this is aimed at people looking at a new laptop for use with FL Studio. And I've got no doubt that that process, that performance is going to increase um, probably on both laptops if ImageLine decide to do decide to do an ARM version of um, FL Studio, which I hope they will. Uh, if they don't, still very usable. Um, no reason why you wouldn't go for either of these two um, laptops. Um, different horses, different courses. Um, I like the Surface laptop the best because I like to put a laptop on my laptop. 
and the you can probably see the Surface Pro 9 is in a cover which I've got which does mean that I can put it on the laptop just fold up quite well let's see if I can just take that off and I'll show you slides forward and down pops over like that so you end up with quite a nice tidy takeaway um, and there's also a, a little thing there for the, for uh, your pen which um, I haven't got to hand I'd say I've lost it but I haven't I know I do know where it is anyway I'm starting to blabber um, thanks very much for your time if you've enjoyed it give it a like if you haven't enjoyed it don't worry um, if you want to see more videos like this then please subscribe thanks very much bye bye